it's Courtney Mermaid here and in today's video I'm gonna be answering all of your questions about my fake gauge earrings All right, so the most commonly asked question I get about these bad boys are they real? No, they are well, they're real earrings. Yes but no, they are not um, real gauge earrings. I do not actually have holes in my head. So this is what they look like. So how they work, uh, which is the probably the most commonly asked question, how they work is they are actually on a stud that just clips in front and back um, and they just, you can kind of hear it a little snap together. Um, so they fit in just like a regular earring. They're actually pretty easy to put in. You gotta kind of wiggle it in. <laughs> you get better at doing this the more that you have to do it. And then, uh, and there you go. And there they are. So they're very light. They do not weigh a lot. I was actually quite surprised with my first pair when I, uh, when I took them off of their little stand and I was like, oh, it's so light. I thought it was gonna like maybe stretch my ear a little bit or be kind of a little droopy or something or too heavy or maybe give me a headache, but I have no issues um, with these earrings at all. Yeah, so the first pair that I got um, were the blue ones. Um, I really wish I could remember the names of all of them now. I feel kind of bad. I think these ones were called Kelp Forest, but I can't remember what these ones were called. Um, but they are a gorgeous, gorgeous style. I love them so much. They're a little bit thinner than the green ones that I have in right now. Um, and they were the first pair that I got in the on the first night that I wore them, um, I actually broke them. So it was raining and I had my umbrella on my shoulder and I was walking the dog and I had to pick up his poop. Real life, guys. And um, the umbrella, a gust of wind came up and ripped the umbrella through and pulled my earring out of my ear and actually snapped the stud off in, in the backer. And I was absolutely horrified, like I cried. It was so sad, I was so bummed. But, um, but I let the, the artist know and, and for a small fee, she was able to fix them for me. And I was so grateful, like I, you have no idea. And then, then the obsession from there just kind of grew and I had to get more. So those are the first ones I got that I was wearing the most. I ended up getting these guys next my beautiful green pair. Um, I got them because they match my mermaid tail, the top half of my mermaid tail, and I wanted something that I could wear with my leggings that kind of looked like it belonged. Plus my scales are also um, this color and it kind of just sort of fits together really nicely, I think. Okay, the next pair that I got that I was ridiculously excited for. Oh my goodness. The little dolphin pair. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. So they are tiny little sculpted dolphins that fit on the same style backer. The only difference is these ones don't click. They kind of squeeze. So they slide into each other and it's just like a little port and it just whoop and they stay connected. So I haven't had a problem with them coming out or anything, but they are so cute. You guys have no idea how cute these are. The, the photos and the video do not do them justice. I like them so much. And the sparkly, like, I don't know how she does that. It's incredible. And the last pair in my collection is these guys. So they're basically the mini version. Um, they're again, a little bit thicker than these guys, but they are the miniature the miniature version um, of the long-tailed uh, tentacles. So these ones are so nice. These are great for more of an everyday kind of a wear because they are shorter. Um, I don't find that they, they aren't as prone to like getting caught in things. So these aren't super, these are gonna be better for warmer months, you know, when you're not wearing a scarf or you're not wearing like a big woolly sweater or something. But these guys, I've been wearing almost nonstop since I got them. Mermaid Kim got me these for my birthday. And um, oh my God, I love them so much. And the color she picked, they're my favorite colors ever. Ah! So good, so I absolutely adore these. So the reason I love uh, fake gauge earrings as much as I do is because I am still a fan of wearing regular style earrings and you can see I do have additional piercings. I've got five piercings total and I do like to wear different style earrings and I feel like if I actually did stretch my, my ears, plus it really hurts and I've heard that it really hurts. <laughs> I'm a bit of a chicken so I don't know if I really want to do that. <laughs> but I do, I do love the flexibility that these give me versus 
actually stretching out my ear. Um, and I'm impatient too, I would want it done yesterday and you know, the, the, it takes time, like stages, right? So, so these are really good if you are somebody who is like me and who's like, oh, I really like this look, but I also like earrings, regular earrings. This is a good option, you know? I also really like them because they're really light. Some of the other um, earrings in this style I've seen have been a lot heavier. And the whole point of this is not to stretch my ears. The whole point is to have just a very light, flexible look. Like I'll actually forget that I'm wearing these. The only time I don't forget is if I'm wearing um, earbuds, like headphones, and sometimes they loop in the top part of the tentacle. <laughs> But that's just habit. Just get in the habit of pulling them down and out instead of just like ripping them out of your ears. So of course now you want to know where you're where you're gonna get them, right? So um, the artist can be found on Etsy. I will leave a link in the description box below. Um, the Slug and Kraken, and she's incredible. Her work is so good, guys. I I know like I should do. I was I I've said I was gonna do like a review, but I am such a fangirl of. <laughs> of her of her product that I'm like there's nothing I could even say negative I have there's no they are perfect in my opinion I love them so so much I I cannot sing her praises enough and I feel like more people in the Mer community should check her out because she offers more than just these earrings she makes all kinds of ocean themed um, jewelry and, and accessories and things that are really incredible. The sculpts that she makes will blow your mind, like actually out your ears. So um, I highly suggest you go check her out and show her some love and, and tell her I sent you. <laughs> I would love to see her a little bit more well known in the mermaid community because her just, they're fantastic. I love them so much and I, mm, they are worth every penny you guys. So good. All right, so the last commonly asked question is, uh, can you swim in them? So I have not personally been swimming in mine because I just, I would die if something happened to them. <laughs> I love them so much, I'm like, please no. Um, but I do know uh, at least one other mermaid who has um, the simple, uh, a simpler style of these. So not this style, but they're just like a, a round, smooth shape. And I know that she's been swimming in hers and hasn't had um, an issue. However, it's gonna be a do it at your own risk kind of a thing. Um, the majority of her jewelry, I don't believe has been tested for use in the water. I'm sure if, if enough of us asked, you know, <laughs> or maybe I'll buy more and I'll, I'll, I'll test it out myself, I don't know. Um, but uh, I would definitely recommend these for a land, uh, land-based um, gigs, so using the water at your own risk. All right, so that's gonna be it for this video. Short and sweet, to the point, hopefully. <laughs> if you guys have any other questions about uh, my fake age earrings, uh, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below and I will be sure to get back to you as best as I can and help you find answers. And on that note, be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it or if you just love fake age earrings as much as I do. And don't forget to go and give that artist some love though. Seriously, she is just, so amazing. Um, and also be sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss any of my mermaid adventures. And uh, that's about it. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Happy swimming and I'll see you next time. Bye.